Hello again. Back for some more panel attack commentary. Today we've got another one of those special sessions. Uh, a request from Light Rider to go over some of his games that he had with Dom, uh, both of whom are gold rank players. And I think they played about a couple dozen games yesterday, so we have them all downloaded and ready to go. And we're gonna jump right into it. Let's head on over. I forgot to put my music on. There it is. Alright, let's get into it. <clears throat> so, Light Rider is on the left, so that's who I'm going to be focusing on. Okay, four chain opener, not bad. Oh, all that time for a seven combo. Okay, Light Rider not dealing with too much offense. Has a chance to deal some more offense here. There we go, there's some small chain combo. Six combo into clear, good. Another six combo, good. Oh, now what I would say about that round is that although they got away with it, uh, Light Rider would have probably benefit from doing more chains that round because if Dom got one clear all that combo garbage is gone instantly and Dom has suddenly tons of resources to work with but chains make that a little less true so it could have just been a one-off let's see maybe we'll see some more chain action here Okay, we got some offense coming in from Dom. Alright, a couple small defensive chains from Light. Looking fairly back and forth still. And lots of combos from Dom if Light gets one clear. And that's going to be lots of panels. There we go. Gets the clear. Looking for some offense. Okay, here we go. Nice. Okay. Four chain. Good offense. And another good clear from Light. Dom sending lots of combo garbage. Uh, Light getting rewarded for it. Oh, but that combo on top. Uh, good shot from uh, Dom there. Like lining up a nine ch combo. Pretty nice, but as you can see on Dom's side. Oh, hold on, that's not the right pause button. Here we go. Uh, those combo uh, garbage blocks, they can just get swept away in one clear. And if Dom does that, then all of Light's offense is effectively gone. There it is, see? Um, but if Light sends some chains along with it, it will become much more effective. Again, you can see Dom clearing the combos very quickly. And then even getting a 3-chain off it. Okay. Ooh, tough situation, okay. Oh, and I am realizing here that these players are on level 10. Which is, um, a little bit unexpected. You usually don't see gold rank players on level 10. But props to them for going for it anyways. Yeah, so far I was gonna say, my advice was, uh, Light Rider do more chains, but then I realized that, yeah, this is level 10. That's probably going to be uh, quite tricky at this level. Okay, let's see this now. Okay, decent starting attack from Light. Ooh. Oh yeah, that was one, one big mistake there that I noticed. Um, 
Dom had quite a large chain. This is the same replay I'm going over. Okay, uh, four. Four. Dom has a four chain six combo and another four combo coming into clear. So, Light is going to have a lot of damage coming. That five combo that Light has lined up there, I would absolutely save that for when Dom finishes his attack because on his side, he's, he's got no clear ready for the next blink. So it's going to fall right then and then pow, get sniped without a clear ready. Aw, oh, missed the insert. Ooh, got those towers going. Aw, oh, didn't downstack them in time. Yeah, I definitely want to watch out for towers, especially on 10. We've almost got the 4 chain. Dom hitting hard though with a 5 chain. Okay, good that Light Rider made that clear uh, into a 4 combo rather than just a 3. Oh, tough spot for Light. Oh, yeah, that was tough. Uh, barely any rows and you, uh, almost no room to downstack. That's tough. Alright, three chain from light. Okay, light's got some decent offense this round. Oh, a couple seven combos. Not especially efficient, but hey, it did the trick that round. Oh, there was one thing I wanted to point out, I think. See, that was a really good uh, good chain right there. That actually ties into what I wanted to mention. And I'm not sure when it is, but I'm sure I'll see it shortly. Oh! No, okay. Um, here, I, gotta, I just have to rewind that one more time. It was with the purples that I saw. My apologies. I swear there's something here. No, I'm not just messing around. Okay. Uh, let me grab my tiny little pointer. Where is it? There it is. My extremely small pointer. So, you've got the purple that's gonna fall down, right? You've got one here. You've got one here. You could easily arrange that, like, just move this over one space, and then take out this uh, light blue. As this is falling, this would drop down, the purple would line up as well, and you would get a four chain six combo out of that. And little things like that, like just recognizing uh, potential patterns for chains is super helpful on 10, because offense can get you uh, Quite a few kills on 10, especially at gold rank, when opponents may not be used to defense so much. So... Yeah, cancel out of that one. It's a little bit hard to say like, okay, just chain better, right? It's, it's not that easy. But... Being able to recognize certain setups that you can use for ch vertical chains... It's, uh, very helpful. One thing that I'm noticing right off the bat, Dom is raising his stack up a little bit first, but Light Rider has not been so much these last few rounds. I see what Light's going for here with the four combo into the blues with the insert, but if Light had a little more room perhaps, oh, I don't, it looks like I was wrong, they changed it up, they might be able to extend their chain even more or get more consistent chains because they've got more panels to work with. And I can understand why you might not want to do that on 10, especially if you're just learning 10, because if you get topped out, if your opponent has a good attack, you're dead, right? Like, defense is not easy on 10. But 
if you can get better at consistent openers and raising your stack up a little more than normal, that can give you an edge if you can use it properly. Okay, light gets the clear. Oh, missed the slide. It's okay, that's tricky. More combo into clear. Oh, almost got another link on that chain. Uh, but yeah, I was topped out. See, Light Rider would have been safe if he got the that chain he was going for, because it would have given him extra stop time to downstack and potentially survive that situation. But yeah, sometimes if you you miss a skill chain, you bet your life on it, and it doesn't work out, I do that way too much. <laughs> Okay, big chain coming in from Dom. That's another situation there I would have said, wait just an extra moment for their attack to come in. So that, like, it's way, way better to be prepared and wait, like, a few seconds than squeeze in a little extra offense and then not be prepared when you've got a big attack coming. Because if Dom sends, like, one more line, it could be GG. Light does get the clear, though, so he is safe. The garbage chain topped out now. Oh yeah, that that brutal one frame of health on ten. Okay. Now a couple lines coming in from light, but oh, good, good four chain. It's excellent. Now, Light would definitely benefit from raising their stack here, because, like you see, there's there was only three rows of panels, and Light does have room. And I know it can be scary, because 10 is a scary son of a gun. But having the resources to work with, and getting slowly more accustomed to having more panels on the screen, is a huge help in getting better at 10. Five garbage chain from light? Okay, that's awesome. And then another clear from light? Looks like light might have the upper hand. Oh, light topped out? Oh, those combos from Dom. That was really good. In a situation like that though, where you may have to downstack, like you don't have a clear ready, and you've got your opponent is definitely going to be throwing more offense to top you out, Try to look elsewhere on your board for just like a four combo, or sorry, a, a two chain perhaps. That can help give you enough stop time to downstack, or prepare a clear, or whatever you need to do, so that you can survive that situation. It can be tricky to get used to for sure, it, 10 is not easy. Okay, not too much offense. Light gets a clear though. Two combo. Sorry, two chain. You'd think I'd know the difference between a combo and a chain by this point, but no, it's quite quite tough. Okay. Light going for another clear. Ooh. That seven combo. Uh, where's my pointy? Okay, I made it. I made it smaller. Um, this blue could have been brought right over here because that seven combo had three dark blues, and if you had added this one, would have been an eight combo, which is tons more effective than seven because seven is a combo size you want to avoid at this level of play because it's pretty inefficient and is easier for your opponent to survive. Okay, good clear. 
Garbage chaining, good. Nice eight. Four chain. Okay, this is good. Dom is gonna be in trouble if Light can survive this. Oh, the towers! Oh, yeah, those are dangerous. You gotta totally watch out for towers. But that was fantastic offense from Light that round. Nice. Four chain with a little extra combo damage on the side. And then a three chain. Okay, like keeping up good pressure this round. I like that. Watch out for those towers though. Down stack those. Okay, I see good good way to down stack. Turn it into a two chain four combo. Here we go. Here comes another chain from light. Yeah, Light, really putting on good pressure this round. Five combo into... Oh, look at this. This is beautiful. Dom is in a lot of trouble now. Come on, Light, you can do it. Okay, nice, clear. Gets rid of all of that combo garbage. Now, if he can put on a little more pressure on Dom, Dom topped out. Keep it up, Light. Oh, shoot. Ah, Dom counterattacked with just enough to win that run, or that round. That was a really good job from Light, though. Really good offense. Okay, a couple small chains from Light. Dealing with a four chain from Dom. Doesn't have too much room to work with. But once he clears this uh, this next layer of garbage, all those combos, okay, they're all gone now. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Use those extra panels for a little offense. Keep Dom busy. Okay, good. Down stack, four combo into clear. Good insert. Good. Oh, here we go. Five. That's good. Oh, one more time. Oh, sh wow, that was quick. Okay. I was going to say, at the end of that round there, Light had a seven combo, which could have easily been made into an eight. Now, I would recommend to Light, if you have a seven, if you see that what you're about to make is a seven, check really quickly and see if there's anything nearby you can make it w into an eight with. Because eights are just... Eights are great. Baby. I'm like looking for something to do here. Couple fours. Okay, here we go. Looks like something. Three chain, five combo. Like putting on decent pressure, but most of it is combo, so it's easily countered. Okay. Two combo six. Two chain six, sorry. Oh no, what happened there? Looked like uh, Light was ready with a almost a four combo into clear, but uh, something happened. Right here, another situation I would recommend to Light, raise your stack up, because if you see Dom's screen, Dom has a five chain going and lots to work with. Now if you can, if you raise your stack up, make sure your next step is to either prepare a clear or get something organized, like maybe a four combo in the corner, so that you've got something for some extra stop time to de defend with. Okay, so here it comes. Ooh! Saved by the ghost match! That is rare. Okay, Light has a good amount of panels to work with, though. Right, working his way towards a clear. Oh, it's a little bit too slow on that garbage chain. Okay, does- oh, that was right. I was gonna say, does Light see the second tier, but uh, he broke it down before it was needed.
Ooh, shock damage coming from Dom. Okay, good buying time until you can get a clear. It almost looked like Light was panicking a little bit, but um, managed to keep it under control. Oh, the rising stack of doom. Yeah, that's a tough situation. Now, one thing that it seems like uh, Light is doing is that when they're playing on 10, when they're just starting out, um, they seem to be making a lot of matches just like, just because, like, maybe seeing if they can make it into a, uh, an active chain or a skill chain after they make a match. I would definitely recommend taking just one or two extra seconds at the beginning of a round to like really look at what you're doing. So if you've got a match, see if you can like just organize a two chain and then by the time that's going off, maybe then see if you can extend it into a three chain with, uh, with as like a skill chain. Good insert into slide. Four combo into clear, okay. Another four combo into clear. Not too many panels though. Okay, got a few extra from the combos that light cleared. This is a really healthy stack size, I would say, for level 10. Like, getting used to having that many panels on the screen is really good. Like, you definitely don't want to be playing in the bottom when you're learning or defending on level 10. Or learning or defending, either one. It might be intimidating, but it is so valuable to learn that. Oh, Dom snipes another quick kill, uh, light not ready with a clear. And this round, you can see it, you saw it again, is that Light um, did a couple of seemingly random matches at the beginning, but then they took the time to build a chain, and now they're making it, it longer with uh, just extensions on the end of it. That's really good, but I would try to avoid making those first matches at the beginning, because they can waste a little bit of time and panels. Unless you're using them to actually make your chain, like if you need to really need to move a couple panels elsewhere, like, alright, go for it. Eight combo, very good. Much better than seven. Play a couple fours. Lots of combos from Dom, all cleared. Oh, here we go, good chain. Five. Great chain. Oh, that's seven. In that case with the seven, I would have probably turned it into a six rather than leave it as seven. Just one little extra thing. Light, raise your stack up, you got nothing! There you go. He was, he was forced to. If he hadn't have raised his stack, he would have been screwed. Oh, he's in a tough spot, though. Okay, gets the garbage clear. And another clear. Okay, very nice. But topped out. Oh. See, right there, when Light did that uh, match of three while he was topped out and didn't have any stop time, he had a four combo in the bottom right corner that he could have popped to get some stop time and then survive. So that's definitely something you want to look out for. It's hard to say if Light was looking out for that or not. Oh, that's replay. Because, uh, yeah, like I said, level 10, not easy. But just to be sure, that's definitely the strategy you want to take there. Okay, 
Full chain, then a four combo into clear. Raise your stack, Light! Raise your stack! He's gonna have to now. Okay, good. Oh! Good combo storm from Light! That was very nice. I didn't even see that. I was looking at Light screen. You just hear the bam 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 on Dom's side, and that is GG. Yeah, I think you can see what uh, Light was going for with the horizontal chain with the greens, but just wasn't quite fast enough. Uh, no fault of his there, it's just the speed of 10 can be quite tough to get used to. 4 chain from Light, very good. And then 3 garbage chain, perfect, look at that. Dom's in trouble, yeah, Light Rider takes a round. Light Rider did raise it up a little bit. I would have probably raised it up a little more. Light working towards a clear, but not many panels to work with. Okay, working on that garbage. Oh, that was a neat chain. Three chain, good. Okay, not too much happening yet. With I was about to say, with that amount of panels, I would try to pump out some extra offense if I was like, get a couple more chains in there to pressure Dom, because you have the resources to do it with. Ooh, good combos there. Yeah, that's some nice pressure. Lots of combos, but there is that free chain as well. Oh, almost got the insert. Okay, two chain into clear. Not a whole lot happening this game. Not too much crazy offense from either player. Okay, here we go. They have four chain from Light. Oh, Light actually won that one. Okay, so something I would recommend, like, if the game is going really slow and your opponent is not really throwing much offense at all, I would do the same thing that I recommended Light do at the beginning for openers. Like, take an extra second, maybe raise that stack a little bit, so that you've got the panels to maybe just arrange a 2 or 3 chain. Push out a little extra offense with the spare panels you'll have. That will really upgrade your gameplay a bit, I think. Here we go. Like pushing his board up a bit and has enough panels to make a 5 chain. That is awesome. And then follows it up with another 2 chain. That is the power of having extra panels. Raises the stack up a little more again. Now he's topped out. But he Ooh, Dom is throwing some offense. Okay, Light with the... Oh, very good. The two combo... Or sorry, two chain was enough to let Light work towards a clear because of that stop time. Light's still in this. Oh, you love to see it. Okay, now Light does have a second tier. Will he utilize it? Well, doesn't need to. Six chain from Light. Oh, but the combos come in from Dom and Light down stacked. Unfortunately, that spelled his doom. Not bad though. Um, here actually, hold on. I'm gonna go back to that round because if there's one thing that I would suggest to Light in that situation is that when you've got a ton of panels, you're doing like a big chain because you just got like a tier connected to your main stack. I would get some stop time. 
like rather than rush to the top and do down stacking or try to make a clear, do that after you get some stop time from like a small combo or something. So we're running through the same situation again. Just do 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 do. Okay, now this is where the light does his pretty nice. Okay, now right here, you can see there's a lot of yellows up top. Light might be thinking, okay, down stack those yellows, maybe survive this and arrange a clear with those. But what I would do is either see those uh, light blues that light has right there on his cursor, or even the reds right here. Those are one move uh, matches you can do. They don't provide any stop time, but they they stop your stop time from going down, as well as, like, for the duration that they're they're popping. Which will give you valuable extra time that you could use to downstack or make it clear with those. Yeah, okay, this is, this is still hilariously big. I'm just gonna... <laughs> yeah, so stop time ran out and GG. Okay. Two chain, oh, seven combo. And another two chain. Definitely hoping light raises their stack. Okay, they have to now. A little more than that, maybe. Come on. Okay, good. Five roses is decent. I like what Light did there. Instead of having that as a 4 combo, he turned it into a 5, which is beautiful. 5s are great. Just a little thing, but that's a, uh, that's a good practice. If you can make it into a 5, definitely do that. And I like getting some combo pressure. Light's gonna have lots of panels. Let's see how he handles this. Oh, he's already doing quite some offense there. Tried to go for the insert, not quite fast enough though. Ooh, gets another clear. Okay, very high stat for Light now. Oh, look at this. I'm not sure if Light even saw that chain that, was, that happened there, but it still worked out. Since it looked like he was going for a different configuration, but got a match when he did not mean to. Ooh, tough situation. Two chain with shocks. Ooh, tough. Okay. I was about to say, that's a tough situation because light down stacked in a way that was maybe not so efficient because Where's my tiny pointer? Appropriately sized pointer now. Um, Light could have kept these two dark blues here and dropped this one down here. Um, effectively creating another solution that he could have used. He did get a solution that I actually didn't see, but... Just gotta make sure you're aware of your options. Now... Oh, he did see the clear in the third tier, but wasn't fast enough. That's another situation where I would make a match or a combo in the bottom tier, and then try to go for your clear. Because then you'll have the time necessary to do it. Okay, has a clear ready for Dom's attack. Good. Well, I see Light wanted to get a, uh, a clear over there, but noticed that it wasn't going to work. It was going to pop early. Uh, not able to down stack the right way. Ah, baby. 
Okay, good. I saw that Light raised his stack up again. That is really good to start out. Even if it's just one or two extra rows, it's a huge help for opener consistency. Oh, looks like he fumbled a little bit. Uh, he had a five combo ready and a, a match over his cursor, but didn't get it off in time. Two chain to clear. And three chain. Oh, eight? Good. That that stack rose up just enough to make that into an eight rather than seven. That's good. Okay, nice bit of offense there. Oh, Light Rider wins that one. Okay, good. Almost got that chain. Okay, another three chain. Oh, see, that was another seven. Could have been made into an eight by just moving this one over one space, and that makes two lines of garbage rather than one. Oh, Light Rider won right then. Okay. Oh, here we go. This is a good one. Oh, just couldn't quite get it into a six, but that's still great. Five chain, very nice. Very few panels, but is ready with the garbage chain. Almost makes it into a six combo there. Oh, okay. He's living. Five chain! Okay, that's gonna put Dom in a tricky situation. Okay. Light working on defense. Burning a little bit of unnecessary panels there with a, a couple of matches. Light wins though. Very good. Oh, the seven. Yeah, I know it's definitely easier said than done, but on on 10, or almost any difficulty at gold level, um, you want to prioritize making chains before doing combos, because Dom gets a clear on the combos, they're all gone. Whereas if it was a chain, it takes much longer to work through. Light's in a tough spot. Okay, gets a clear. No stop time. Oh, very lucky two chain there. Oh, that's another tough spot. Oh, uh, and he did buy a little bit of extra time with that uh, that three match, but didn't make anything else after it, and that cost him as he was topped out. Hard to say if he was looking for anything else at that point, but it was good that he did make, make that match just to get a little extra time. It's a good habit to get into. All right, four chain, six combo, good. Oh, so six combo into clear, actually. Always like gonna look at the second tier. Nope. Okay, it doesn't need to. Oh, good. Okay. Three chain into clear. That's gonna be a five? No, four and a six. Four chain six combo. Light takes a win. Nice round. That was good performance there. Oh, I missed the, uh, looks like an insert, I think that was. Okay, 4 chain, very good. 
again, that's the, uh, light moved it afterwards, but you could just move that green right there, and then it would have made an 8. And it's just such a buff to your offense. Oh, another 7. Oh, no. Okay, another 4 chain, very good. Okay, lucky two chain, another two chain. Oh, couldn't quite get the horizontal insert. Okay, good. Uses the stop time to run. get the easy clear up there. Working on another garbage chain. Here we go. Here's some high stack defense going. not able to form anything else after running out of stop time. That was pretty good though. Alright, 6 combo into 2 chain, 4 combo into 3 chain. Ooh, that put good pressure on Dom there. If they weren't careful, that could have been a quick kill. Another 6 combo. Ooh, that was a good, uh, chain from Light. Yeah, I think I would probably suggest that if if Light has the advantage or just doesn't have much garbage at all, raise the stack up a little bit and try to arrange a chain rather than doing many combos. Because Dom's got no more chain garbage left, Dom clears all the combo garbage instantly. And then has tons of panels to counterattack with. Okay, does light see the- uh, oh, I was gonna say clear with the blues, but shifted it up totally there. That's a situation where, um, it's good to be aware of if you can make an easy down stack so that your, your match or combo will connect to the garbage and clear it, definitely do that, because here it was the four combo with the purples. If you move this light blue down, that would have cleared the garbage and then given you much speedier clear overall. Okay, light gets the clear in. Oh, look at all those panels coming in. Two chain with shocks. Ooh, that's a neat chain. Hey. Down stacking that tower with a 5 combo. Good, you topped out but using good stop time. Getting a nice chain going. Ooh, light just barely makes the clear. That is awesome usage of stop time. It cut pretty close there, but that was really nice. And then Light Rider wins. Very well done. That was a great, uh, great defense there. Not too much offense from Light yet. Oh, whoa, that was a cool chain. I like that. Good chain from Light. Oh, not quite able to extend that one, but... 
Lots of small chains are pretty good, as long as they're not two chains, because two chains, not very effective. Anything higher than that, even a three chain, is very good, because it uh, layers the garbage and gives your opponent... Well, it makes it a bit less easy for them to just generate free panels from your garbage. You know what I mean? Okay, light's pretty high up. H, 8 combo, very good. And gets a clear, nice. Now this situation... Oh, okay, light wins. I was gonna say... No garbage, and Dom's in a tough situation. Tr um, try to build either a couple quick combos to finish Dom off, or set up a chain and like really give Dom pressure in case he's able to defend from it. How many do we have? We're at 12.47. Okay, just a few more. Oh, not quite quick enough for the chain to chain that, but... Good. Okay, another three chain and change. And then a garbage chain coming in. Hard to say, did Light see the clear in this? Oh yeah, okay, he did see the clear in the second tier. Uh, probably would have gone for it earlier, before it was too late. A combo and the slide. Okay, and then another th three chain with six combo. See, that's quite, or er, piling up quite nicely on Dom's side, but cleared easily because a lot of it was uh, combo garbage. Good four chain. I gotta say, Light Rider's making some chains that, like, I'm not even seeing myself. That's pretty cool. You can definitely see a difference in chaining style. Not enough time to down stack. Okay, yeah, good. Raise that stack up a little bit. Good chain there. Okay, now right here. Nothing from Dom. Or not yet, or very little, I would say. Arrange a combo. Or, sorry, not a combo, a chain. I keep getting them mixed up. My apologies. Like, try to build a chain so that you've got something you can extend off and get some guaranteed offense out. Combos are okay, but if you throw too many of them, then it's just giving your opponent free panels if they're not topped out. Raise that stack! Raise it higher than that! Come on! Hey, it worked out. Alright, good stuff. Oh, nice. Oh, not quite quick enough for the seven, but six, still really good. It's gonna keep Dom busy. Now, I would... Push the advantage. Here we go. Yeah, here's some chains coming in. Oh, not able to extend that one. But look at that. Dom totally pressured. Light takes a quick victory. Well done. Oh, good timing on that uh, last link of that chain. Six chain. Like putting out some great openers these last couple rounds. And then following it up with a 4 chain. Look at that. Dom is in trouble now. Oh, and, the, and another 3 chain. Okay, now, 
when you start hearing those do -do 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 -do, those like high pitched ting sounds coming from your opponent clearing blocks, you know they've got a big chain going. See that? Uh, oops, where's my pointer? See these here? Keep those there. Raise your stack up a little bit and keep that for when Dom releases his attack. Let's see if Light Rider does that. Oh no! Yeah, see, if if Light had kept that there, he would have had an easy clear. And oh, okay, Light Rider still wins, which is good, of course. Um, but yeah, just definitely want to be careful of being prepared for big attacks coming in. One of the big attack from Dom. Okay, Light has a clear prepared, that's good. Oh, tough situation. Yeah. Okay, four chain opener, that's good. Two chain, no follow up though. You see, I was gonna say if I was light, I would have down stacked those, which he did, and then raised the stack more so that you've got more things to uh, chain with. But he does have some panels coming in from the garbage. Down stack and clear with the purpose, good. Okay, topped out, but has. Oh, didn't quite buy enough time. I saw what he was going for there, the uh, match with the Reds. That's tough. Raise that stack a little bit. You need more panels than that. Okay, it's rising up naturally, giving light a few more panels. Four chain from light, good. Okay, light not able to make a garbage chain off that one. How about this one? Nah, no, not quite. It's like Light having trouble firing any offense this round, or major offense. Okay, Light sees the combo, or the chain going, I mixed it up again. Nice, that's gonna put Dom in a, in a tricky spot because he's, he's topped out and he's got quite a rift in his board. Oh, shocks, good. I was gonna say, yeah, Light would absolutely benefit more from raising his board up, especially when his opponent is uh, on the back foot. He can really push the advantage, put out some more offense, and pressure his opponent enough to potentially win the game. Good, here we go. Oh, almost a six, but uh, miss swapped a couple times there. That's okay. We take fives, those are great. And Light wins it. And I think that's our last replay. Yeah, it is. Okay, awesome. So, good job to both players. Um, I'm going to put my thoughts or my summary of the main things that I would suggest for Light Rider to focus on in the description below, uh, instead of just summarizing it right now, because there were a few things on my mind there that I don't want to forget anything. But until then, hopefully this has been an insightful um, doo -doo 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 analysis 
and hopefully you learned something from it. Uh, Light, same thing, same to you. Hopefully you watch this and upgrade your gameplay a bit. Uh, anyways, I will see you guys later. Thanks for watching. What?